Hi, my name is Lindsay and welcome to my channel. I do a mix of motherhood and lifestyle content and I would love to have you stick around for future videos so please subscribe and also give this video a like. And today I'm doing a tag video where I share 10 baby names that I love but that I won't be using. And I'm also doing this video in collaboration with another YouTuber. So if you want to see more baby names, more ideas, you can go check out her channel. Her name is Nicola and she does a lot of the same type of content and she has a beautiful little girl and if you want to check out her channel i will link that below and you can go watch her video so in this video like i said i am sharing the 10 baby names that we love and obviously didn't use and if you don't already know i have a little boy who is almost eight months old his name is hayden so that's the name that we ended up choosing and i absolutely love his name and it suits him so well right now and i just think as he gets older it's just such a handsome name and i just can't wait to see the little person that he becomes and at the end of the video i am also going to share our actual choice for a baby girl name uh, had our child been a girl this is the actual name that we would have used and we only plan on having one baby so there's a 99 percent chance that none of these names will be used um if by chance we do have another child you know maybe one of these names would be used or maybe i'd like something different down the road but yeah i am sharing my actual choice for a girl name today so that's the very last name that i'll be sharing so stick around for that and let's get started. I have a list that I'm looking at. So the first boy name that we love and obviously didn't use was the second runner up for like Hayden's name had we not chose Hayden. This one was like we were we were going back and forth and that is the name Ethan. Uh, which is kind of different from the name Hayden in my mind at least Hayden seems like a very like more kind of a more modern name and Ethan seems like almost like a more sophisticated and mature name um, so yeah we ended up choosing Hayden even though I really do love the name Ethan and the next name is on the girl side um, so this is the a name that I really liked for a really really long time uh, and it's because it starts with an L. My name's Lindsay and for the longest time I was trying to think of like L names just for I don't know my own selfish reasons But the name Lila is a name for a girl that I really really love uh, I like that it's short but two syllables I really tend to like go for like shorter names and I love two syllable names So the name Lila for a girl is near the top of my list and the next boy name is the name Alex and I really like the name Alex I'm not a huge fan of like the longer version just because I don't love longer names but Alex on its own for a boy I really like the name for a boy or a girl but for me it's more of a boy name the next girl name on the list that I really love is Charlie again I think it would be cute for like a boy or a girl but I love it as a girl name because I just think it really modernizes it so Charlie for a little girl I just think is so so cute and the next one for my boy list is the name Noah and I just really like that name uh, probably was like brought on by like the movie The Notebook I just love it and we decided against Noah like earlier on I just also just felt that the name was a little bit too biblical and old um, even though I think it can totally sound like new and modern now uh, we just decided against it the next one on my girl list is the name Chloe uh, I really love that name I just think it's like so pretty uh, I like that it's short and two syllables um, but yeah it just seems like such a pretty name and it's not really any names that like I grew up with like um, they're more common now like in the 2000s and 2010s and stuff um, so yeah the name Chloe I think is so pretty for a girl and the next one on my list for a boy is the name Leo and that one I love for many reasons I like that it's short I like that it's two syllables and I like that it starts with an L um, we decided against it just um, just there's just other names that we liked more and also with the popularity of Jillian Harris and her cute little boy Leo uh, we just decided against it. I didn't want it to seem like I was like copying in any way so we decided against that one a long time ago 
Next one for a little girl, the name Olivia. I really love that name. Again, I just think it's so pretty. Um, I didn't grow up with any Olivia's and it just sounds like different to me, even though it's, it is um, popular nowadays. So yeah, I really like the name Olivia. And just a pretty name, kind of similar to like Chloe. I just think that they're like along the same lines. My last one on the boy side is a one syllable name. It's the only one syllable name one on my list and it is the name Cruz. And I just really like that name. I just think it's cute and uh, will also just grow up and to be like a mature and handsome name. Uh, and I just really like it for a one syllable name, but we just didn't go with it because I definitely wanted a two syllable name. And the last one on my list is our actual girl name. Had Hayden been a girl, this is what we would have named our little girl. And the name uh, is not really on any popularity lists. It's an older name, though the short version of the name is on popularity lists now. So we really like the name Eleanor for a little girl. And I just think that it's just so cute. It is like an older name, uh, but I think lots of those older names are becoming modern again. And I just love the name Eleanor. And for short, we would have called her Ella, which is very popular right now, the name Ella. Um, and I just think it's so pretty, so cute. And yeah, so that's it that's it for today's video and subscribe if you're new uh, i'd love to have you here thanks bye